Over the news comes this news bulletin of Martin Luther King being killed. They had taken our favorite child. I was just devastated, just that somebody could plan and plot to kill such a man of peace. It was just unbelievable. And this police car come racing up 7th Street with a loudspeaker saying, get off, get off the street, everybody get off the street, immediately. We didn't know what was going on. Unfortunately, I don't think many people were thinking strategically and politically. It was emotional. All you could see was fire, and then people running and screaming and crying, 7th Street was a mess. We came to Florida Avenue and had to, 7th Street bus had to turn there because the, the block in front of us was a blaze, like, uh, like a battle scene in a movie. 7th Street, uh, U Street, 14th Street, they were, they were the commercial corridors and people were, I think, striking out, you know, where they considered the, the uh, power structure was. All in the Shaw area, it was just just burned and torn apart. Where we shopped, where we bought anything like food, drink, anything like that, it was gone. It was a terrible, terrible situation. It was everything was all burned up, boarded up, out of business. My concern was what happens after April 4th? What's going to be the long-term lesson? It took a long time for D.C. to come back. 